step into my time machine, as today we're journeying back five millennia to a time before recorded history. Our destination, Eridu, considered the earliest city in southern Mesopotamia and possibly the world. Built along the banks of the Euphrates River, Eridu's origins go back to 5000 BCE, and it's credited as the cradle of Sumerian civilization. Join me as we peel back the layers of history and take an intimate look at life, lore, and legacy of this forgotten city. Before we delve deep into Eridu, remember folks, this is not your average history channel. Your likes, comments, and subscriptions fuel our journey through time, so don't miss out on our historical treasure troves. Be sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon for all future voyages back in time. Now, let's lift the veil from some of the archaeological marvels uncovered from Eridu. A primary symbol of this civilization are its ziggurats, huge stepped structures renowned for their architectural brilliance. Another fascinating find clay tablets, the very ones that hold our earliest known form of writing, cuneiform. Eridu continues to yield treasures, from beautifully crafted pottery to intricate seal carvings, each piece a story of human resilience, ambition, and ingenuity. The stories of Eridu weave an indispensable part of Sumerian mythology. It was the dwelling place of the water god Enki, who played a critical role in the creation epic, the Eridu Genesis. Enki's wisdom and benevolence gave Eridu its unique status, establishing it as a model city for mankind in ancient lore. Let's delve deep into these tales and uncover hints of truth embedded in mythology. Walk with me through the streets of Eridu as we explore life in ancient times. With a robust economy rooted in agriculture and trade, Eridu was a bustling hub of activity. The socio-political structure was centered around a theocratic system, with the priest-king holding ultimate power. From the grandeur of its ziggurats to the hustle-bustle of its marketplace, Eridu paints a vibrant picture of life in Mesopotamia's earliest city. Welcome back to our exploration of Eridu. Let's look at some of the architectural masterpieces that set Eridu apart from other ancient cities. Most notably, the Iabzu temple dedicated to the god Enki stood tall and magnificent, reflecting the religious significance of the place. Archaeologists have uncovered remains of several other grand buildings, suggesting that Eridu was an advanced civilization, far ahead of its time. The city planning, too, was meticulous, pointing to a highly organized society. As we delve deeper into the history of Eridu, it's impossible to ignore the impact this city had on other Sumerian urban centers. Historians believe that Eridu served as a model for the development of later urban centers. Its advanced architectural designs, city planning, and possibly even socio-political structures influenced the growth of other emerging cities. This ripple effect of Eridu's legacy can be traced back through ancient history, highlighting its central role in the evolution of civilization as we know it today. Having seen the pinnacle of Eridu's advancement and the valuable lessons we can learn, it's time to draw some conclusions from this cradle of civilization. Foremost, the city exemplifies the ability of humans to create complex societies and urban centers thousands of years ago. Moreover, Eridu's archaeological remains remind us of the cyclical nature of civilizations, rising and falling, yet always leaving an undying legacy. Lastly, it serves as a testament to human ingenuity and the innate desire to progress and innovate. Before we bid adieu, don't miss out on more such historical treasures and adventures here at Battle Historian.